What's going on you guys? My name is Megan. Welcome to This Past Romance. This is my YouTube channel where I talk to you guys about all the romance books I have been reading. Today is my August TBR. Our setup is a little bit different. Um, I'm kind of pulling an Izzy. Um, I'm channeling my inner, my inner happy for now. Trying to block the sunlight. Um, I had a, where you guys are positioned, it was a desk. Um, and I had a desk chair and that's why I would sit my camera on my bed and you would see the desk in the background. I got rid of the desk. Actually, I didn't. You just can't see it. It's right here. Um, and I bought a bookshelf and put it together. You guys are on my bookshelf right now. I'm so sorry about the glare. Like I said, this is my August TBR. These are all the books that I want to read in the month of August. Um, I, I'm not going to take too long to talk about these. Let's just go ahead and let's jump in. The first book that I want to read in August is Caged by Lorelai James. Um, he's an MMA fighter. You guys know me. I love my MMA fighters. Um, and I actually bought this book for like $1.99 or something. Um, I get these emails like book bubs or something. And every day they send me emails about books that are on sale, audiobooks, whatever. And you find out like what kind of deals you can score. And, um, Cage was one of them in the last couple weeks. And I bought it. I haven't read it yet though. So, I think my Goodreads says that I have because I opened it to show my cousin something, but I haven't, I haven't read it yet. Um, next book on the list is It Happened One Summer by Tessa Bailey. You guys know, I love Tessa Bailey. She's fantastic. I love her. Um, and It Happened One Summer was on my books on my radar list. This is the, um, Schitt's Creek book where the main character is supposed to be based on Alexis from Schitt's Creek. I've never really watched Schitt's Creek. I'm little I have watched I wasn't I wasn't like excited about so um it is however available on audio on Scribd so if you're looking for it and maybe you don't want to buy it and your library is out of out of um like copies for it check Scribd if you like to listen to things on audio um Scribd would be it is on Scribd um next book which I'm also super excited about because I've, I've talked to uh at least one person who's read the arc um and that is twisted game by anna wong you guys know i love twisted love by anna wong um it was a brother's a dark brother's best friend romance this is the second book and it is a bodyguard romance with a princess and according to izzy um there's a throne scene so i asked her i was like izzy you i see you finished it which one was better and she was like the throne scene and this one was fantastic I can't pick a favorite so I'm really excited to read this book when it comes out um and it comes out at the end of July so it comes out sometime this week and I will read it in August um next on the list is actually a Brianna Hill book I want to read Dom Fitness which is a BDSM fitness club I'm branching into the darker stuff and I'm excited to um see what this is about and I'll, I'm reading Dom Fitness because I want to see, um, what is it, Jim Bunny? I want to read Jim Bunny. I want to read the second book in the series. So I, I feel like i got to read this one first. The next book that I want to read is Exposed by Kristen Callahan. This is a book talk book, um, but it is an enemies to lovers, rock star romance. And those are two tropes that I am a big fan of. So, um, I also would like to read in August. I have a lot of books. Um, it's Not You, It's Me by Julie Johnson. Um, the heroine doesn't believe in love. The hero is supposed to make her believe in love. I don't know. It sounds interesting. I also would like to read Heart Recaptured by Tilly Cole. This is the second book in the Hades Hangman series. I have begged Tamika multiple times to tell me to purchase the entire Hades Hangman series. Um, it's like $30 for eight books. <laughs> and I'm dying to do it because I loved that first book so much. Um, so I'm going to, I'm going to buy the second one. Um, and if I like it, then I'm going to buy the book, buy all of them. I also, I'm, I'm really excited about this one because I didn't realize that this book was like out and I didn't realize it was a new release, I guess. I, I knew it was out, but I thought that it was an older book. Um, and that's How Sweet It Is by Dylan Newton. Um, She's a wedding planner that ends up having to plan a book launch for a horror novelist. You can't tell me that doesn't sound interesting. I 
I'm so excited. I can't wait to read it. I'm really pumped to read it. And last is another book talk book, but it is The Road to Finding Us by Kat Singleton. It's a brother's best friend, and I saw it on TikTok. You guys know I'm always willing to read a brother's best friend romance just to see if I like it. This video was really quick. I know. Next week will be my July wrap up. It's not going to be very long. You can thank John Mayer for that. Um, but also, starting next week, <laughs> uh, I'm going to start posting two videos a week. Starting in August, um, you get two videos a week from me. Are you excited? I'm excited. So, yeah, um, that's all I got. Short and sweet and to the point. So, um, if you guys have any questions, leave them down below. Let me know what you're reading next month. What book are you most excited to read? That is my nephew. He just got a Spider Man game and he is very excited about it. Um, let me know what you guys are excited to read next month. Um, leave us an emoji down below. And I will talk to you guys on my next video. Bye, everyone.